SD Express is a revolutionary innovation, giving both SD and micro SD memory cards the fastest data transfer speeds ever, along with an advanced communication protocol. SD Express uses the PCIe and NVMe architectures alongside the proven SD interface for backwards compatibility. PCIe's faster data transfer speeds paired with the advanced NVMe command layer open numerous opportunities for new use cases that requires high performance content transfer or multitasking operations. The SD7 specifications introduced for SD Express and micro SD Express cards use a single lane of PCIe 3.1 with a top speed of 985 megabytes per second. The SD8 standard for SD Express cards use two lanes of PCIe 4.0 and reach top speeds approaching four gigabytes per second. PCIe with NVMe are the de facto leading storage architectures in systems requiring high performance. This combination of leading technology standards opens a world of possibilities for products of all types requiring removable storage. SD Express may operate alongside PCIe NVMe embedded storage or replace embedded storage in a host device. SD Express offers unbeatable controller latency by using NVMe and PCIe architectures. The PCIe interface provides a significant maximum power reduction and longer battery time compared to SD UHS-1. SD Express cards support the low power substates as defined in PCIe 3.1, allowing minimal power consumption during idle time, as well as several max power operational limits through its NVMe power states, delivering efficient power throttling control. Considering its significantly smaller differential interface voltage, when compared to UHS-1 signals, along with its much higher bursts of data transfer, the total consumed energy of the card becomes significantly lower. And last but not least, the PCIe interface supported by SD Express is significantly better in noisy environments or cases when cards may be connected through a distant cable or additional connectors, such as in automotive and IoT applications. That is achieved thanks to the AC coupled interface that isolates the DC signals from the host to the card, removing common mode errors and protecting against input voltage fault conditions. SD Express will be offered on SD and micro SD form factors at HC, XC, and UC capacity ranges. SD Express employs a unique set of pins on the back of the cards to achieve the fastest speeds, depending upon the SD specification and card form factor. The first row supports a legacy SD interface. The second row is for a single PCIe lane, and the third row is to support the case of two PCIe lanes. SD Express delivers interoperability with a robust SD ecosystem of products and services. By adding PCIe to the existing SD UHS-1 interface, SD Express memory cards operate interchangeably in both new SD Express equip hosts as well as with the billions of existing SD host products in the market today. Adding SD Express to products is quite easy. Existing off-the-shelf building blocks can be used with just a few small additions. A basic SD Express host uses a standard PCIe interface supporting hot plug beside a standard SD host controller based on the SD host controller specification version 3.0 or higher with two added signals, PCIe NVMe interface enable and VDD2 on. In addition, a signal switching mechanism, such as an analog switch or tri-state drivers, should be added to allow the switching between the shared signals, namely the PCIe's reference clock plus two sideband signals, and then the four SD data lines. Here's an example of a complete SD Express host structure. Now, let's see the operation flow of SD Express card insertion. The card is detected by the SD host controller interface and SD driver. The host initiates the SD card and checks whether it supports PCIe interface. After the host confirms PCIe support, first the host sets VDD2 on to indicate to the card to switch to PCIe mode, as well as to control the MUX to transfer the PCIe signals. Then it asserts PCIe card present using the PCIe NVMe interface enable bit. This indicates to the PCIe host interface that a PCIe card was inserted. From that moment, the control will pass to the PCIe drivers and PCIe interface operation using the standard PCIe NVMe drivers. These operations only require a small update of the SD drivers, while the PCIe NVMe drivers remains unchanged. 
The detailed changes for the SD drivers are provided in the SD Express Host Implementation Guideline and SD Host Controller Spec Version 7.0. Note that this is just an implementation example that recommends initiating first through the SD interface and then switching to PCIe if supported. If desired, host vendors may implement the SD Express host so that the SD Express card will initiate first through its PCIe interface and switch to the SD interface if PCIe is not supported by the card. This optional initiation is allowed by the SD Express specification. Once the SD Express host device is ready, it can accept both SD Express or regular SD memory cards. Peak SD Express capabilities only occur with SD Express memory cards. An SD host will operate at SD UHS-1 speeds if an SD Express memory card is used. To make SD Express product development even easier, there are PCIe to SD Express interface converters available from a variety of SD Association members. SD Express offers product manufacturers new ways to use storage in devices. It supports the most demanding performance requirements across a wide variety of industries and applications. For more detailed recommendations on implementing SD Express into your products, download the free SD Express Host Implementation Guideline and download our other white papers on SD Express. And then be sure to join the SD Association to gain access to all of the specifications and licenses as well as collaborate with other members of the SDA.